What's going on, guys? My name is Alex. You can call me Alpha Sip Anime, and we're back with another reaction, another episode. Episode 262 of the Naruto Spring Watcher. Man, I remember when, like, we hit the episode 250, and I was like, man, you know, that we're at the halfway point, and man, that seems like I literally recorded that, like, yesterday or something. But no, here we are, you know, episode 262, just rolling right on through it. I know there was, like, four filler episodes, but still, you know, we're still, we're still uh, trucking on through. So last episode, Gara was, like, he gave a big speech that like made everyone respect him and made everyone stop like bickering around with each other in the middle of everything and he's commanding that big army and you know like the whole Zetsu army they moved out now Gara's you know and he's a commander in chief but he, you know his entire army they're all moving out they're all doing like you know little Naruto running across the fields right now wow that felt good to stretch like that oh apparently this is like the biggest arc in the entire show apparently this like war lasts throughout the rest of the show and I could see why dude there's so much that could happen like there's so many reanimated shinobi that could like you know bring up several episodes worth of backstory to each like shinobi that they come across i don't know dude there's so much is about to go down right now but anyways guys we're about to hop into it right now please thumbs up on the video make sure you comment down below i am going to go over these comments one day once i'm done with the show after everything is spoiler free you are going to want to make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel just hit that little red button down there you know help make my day uh don't miss any of these future uploads i do attempt to post daily so make sure you don't miss any of that and if you do want to watch these episodes a week before they hit youtube Go down in the description, check out that Patreon link. That is where you're going to find all those videos, and they're all unedited, full length, no ads, nothing like that. You're going to enjoy it. So go check that out if you want to help directly support the channel. And guys, right down there in the description, check out that Twitch link. I have started streaming here pretty recently. I've uh, streamed a couple of times. So make sure you just hit that link, hit the little follow button, and then close out the tab and come back and finish this video. Hey, with all that being said, guys, let's hop into the episode. I am going to be enjoying a little snack during my episode today. The pretzel M&Ms? Fire. Oh, my bad. Fire. Well, he about to be, do be doing some overthinking, I can already tell. He'll be alright. War in my lifetime? What if we suddenly come under a surprise attack? And and if you're attacking everyone else is killing you're the sole survivor, I think you got bigger issues. Tortured. I honestly think it'll be worse to be tortured than it would be to be killed. And then they make me fight against Karui and... <sighs> Oh boy! Are you listening? Bro, I just saw some. What if each shinobi that they kill from the Ally Shinobi Force? What if as they die, like let's say Kakashi died, right? Let's say they killed Kakashi and then immediately brought him back reanimated to fight on the enemy's side. That would be wild. That's what I would do if it was, you know, if I was the enemy here. Heading down. We're above enemy territory right now. What is it? So this war, it's your first one, right? Yeah. Nervous at all? Of course he's nervous. He's just trying to, you know. We'll hinge on the results of our unit's attacks. As will the casualty count. We think about succeeding. He's gotta. He's gotta be tough, you know. That's just for a time. He's just not like down himself. He's got good confidence. All right. We got 232, so I need to go to four. Yeah, that was right. I feel like I've heard that intro before. Is that, does that go, yay, yay, yay? I feel like I've heard it. That's odd. So, These look like feudal lords. should we evacuate then? will likely become a battlefield okay these are those villages the smaller nations um i forget what they called them hidden something hidden frost or something Someone like villages like that they're probably just bringing them to the leaf to protect them please be patient you know now that i think about it i was probably just conan wasn't part of this Allied Shinobi Force because there are tons of Hidden Rain Ninja. And I guess after Pain died, she was technically the leader of the Hidden Rain. And she was against the Akatsuki at that point. So, well, they probably wouldn't want to work with her after, you know, knowing she was a part of them. They've been bombing this whole area indiscriminately. Yeah, at this point, Datara could just, Datara could just, you know, do that giant self-exploding bomb and just decimate everything around him because... He doesn't have to worry about killing himself. So Honestly, Dater is probably the most dangerous, dangerous one out of a lot of them right now. The insects interfere, a sense chakra. 
Infiltration and recon unit guys are good. Our answer to those insects. Dude, I'd be freaking out. Data is low key dangerous, dude. Like, even aside from being like pretty much immortal right now. Damn it. Get to HQ. Go quickly. That dude's gonna be able to sense that chakra leaving, though. We'll make our stronghold right here. Set up delayed explosive traps. Omoi. <laughs> Go set paper bomb traps. I feel like those are mighty small little regiments to have in, when you have a battle strength of 80,000. Tongo, set up a chakra communication antenna. Relax, I'm a sensory type ninja, so you're all in good hands. You must remain cautious. Yeah, I know, I know. So, is there anything else I should be aware of for now? Kabuto uses Orochimaru's <coughs> ninjutsu known as the reanimation jutsu. How's he know that? Their souls held in bondage. And they can't be killed no matter what you hit them with. Even if you kill the caster, the jutsu will not come undone. Really? Make finding and capturing Kabuto top priority. We're still undo this bothersome jutsu. If you can. Can you imagine how much trouble it would have saved if Donza was just able to use that power to convince Madara to fight to protect the Leaf Village? That would have been it. That would have been the end of the show right there. Naruto is putting the end, you know? <laughs> and you know what? I'm, I'm almost willing to bet that unit where uh, Conqueror is and Sai, I think Daedara uh, and Sasori and Sai's brother are going to end up going to where they are. I mean, it just makes sense, right? Sai with his brother and then uh, Conqueror with Sasori. Wow. This is a jamming jutsu. A jamming jutsu? Something's coming. I'm willing to bet it's that team I just said. Is it the enemy? Oh, he made it. Uh, wait, that's Muta. He's from the Avarami clan, part of the advanced scouting party. It's booby trapped out there. I'll get him. Are you alright? Oto. Yeah, I know. Byakugan! Get away from me! The insect bag that he has on his back doesn't contain any Aburame clan insects inside it! Oh! Get back here! It's Sasori. <clears throat> I'm sorry! Everyone run! Can't be! Look, and he's... That's why I told you to be cautious! So, what do we do? I'm on it. Massive chakra inside the insect bag Dude. on Uta's back. Etan, do it. Earth style, mobile core. Data. Yeah. <clears throat> Dog. Data is like real famous amongst the stone. Then, look, and is that Sai? Did he just smile, or was he like something about that didn't sit right? Maybe it was just maybe it was just my misinterpretation. Did they all blow up? Still there. <laughs> wow, impressive. Woo! That was actually really cool. Couldn't say the Aburame guy. Damn it, to work on healing Zaji. Right. No time to even mourn our comrade's death. So that's war, huh? Dang, dude, that sucks. Damn. For the time being, there's your leaf ninja, right? Those two are. Yeah. Tokuma and Ronka. Are they being manipulated? More above. Nice side. We'll keep your friends alive for a while yet. Side didn't realize who that was. What now? Dude, my heart's about to come out of my chest. Dirty, I once I didn't realize who that is. Now show yourself. You're a commando unit too, right? It's a little strange for commando units to engage each other like this. Our side initiated this entire conflict. Yeah, okay. We will not lose. You think Let's go. So? Because we are immortal. Size. Look. 
What is it? Impossible. Run away, little brother. Oh, chills. No way you can win. Oh, man. Pain, brother. This is what Kabuto wanted. What a touching reunion. They're intentionally pitting us against people that we know and care about. That's how I would do it. No, ben, no mercy! There's no room for niceties. Can Sai bring him something like hurt his brother though? Brother, step out of it. Dude, this is constant chills. I must hand it to you, Sasori, my good man. Cloud style. What is that just okay? <clears throat> Was he not expecting him to cut this? In front, but he actually slashes back. So okay. Stupid. Severed all my chakra threads. That's some swordsmanship. Now! Oh, he attached his chakra threads to his chakra threads. Wow. And he's bringing the ground up, and that made. Oh, they're making y'all look dumb. I'd say we're doing pretty well. This is the first time that I've seen you. In that form. Seems your thread handling skills. Oh yeah, Conqueror awesome. never saw Sasori like this. Kankuro, never did I imagine that you would still be alive. Mm-hmm. So Sakura. You and I would fight again. Wow. This was in Shippuden. This feels like so much like Hold further right back there. than that. Man, just thinking like when we first saw them, I was thinking like, wow, nine Akatsuki members like I'm pretty sure there's more than that. And it's like we know them all. Like if you show me any Akashi member right now, I'm gonna like think about like their entire backstory. Well, except Kakazu. I don't think we got a backstory on Kakazu or Hidon. Or Datara. We never got any backstory on Datara either. Salamander. I'm the one who created them. The legendary master craftsman of the puppet core. Sasori. Sasori of the red sand. It's over. I won't finish you. I'll just let the yeah, see, and he ends up not dying anyways. Don't you feel dumb? Should have just finished it while you had the chance. I owe you, Sasori. No, oh, Sasori's like, I made a mistake. Oh! <laughs> Imagine Sasori right now. He's probably like, I know he did not just make a puppet out of my body. Wow, this episode's over already. That happened fast. I don't know. I guess like munching on like the M&Ms, I guess maybe it just kind of flew by. That's the end of this episode. Okay, so dude, just like I thought, Kabuto is pitting these people against each other. So he's like putting Sai with his brother and Konkuro with Sasori. But, you know, Datara being there, that's just kind of an extra, I guess. You would think they would put Datara wherever Onoki is? Well, I guess Datara didn't really have any connection with anyone. But you actually... As far as Kangaroo goes, instead of putting him up against Sasori, you would think they would bring, like, Granny Chio. Well, I don't know if Granny Chio could, like, fight Gara, maybe? I don't know. We're gonna keep on watching, of course. This show is just getting too good right now, man. Like, I don't even want to stop. It's getting to the point where it's... What, what time is it right now? It's 4.12 in the morning. I need to be getting to work. I need to leave here for work at 6.30, so I need to get ready a little before then. And So, you know, I'm telling myself, like, okay, how many more episodes can I watch? But I also need to edit my episode for today, you know, because when I go to work, I don't get back home from work until, like, 4 p.m. usually, and the video has to be up by 2 p.m., so I need to make sure I set aside some time to edit these videos so I can have today's upload. But whole boat of ideas, you know, whole process of things that I need to make sure I do before I leave for work. I'm asking myself, like, dude, I really want to watch another episode, but I don't know if I have the time. But anyways, guys, if you do enjoy the content, please thumbs up on the video make sure you put a comment down below i am gonna go back over these comments one day when there are no more spoilers for me to be spoiled of and guys make sure you subscribe to the youtube channel if you're not subscribed yet make sure you don't miss any of these uploads i do attempt to post daily and if you do want to watch these episodes a week before they hit the youtube channel make sure you go down in the description check out that patreon link that is where you're gonna find all those videos in their full link unedited all that good stuff no ads so go ahead and check it out sounds like something's gonna interest you and while you're down there in the description guys make sure you hit that little twitch link hit the little follow button and make sure you don't miss the next time i go live on twitch and come and join up in the chat room guys and we'll hang out all right and with all that being said i'll see you on for next episode. Peace.